Yes, yes, boys, Kizan back with another Darkened Battle video. And if you have clicked on this video, there is a high chance that you may or may not have got shafted on those sixth anniversary banners. But I'm here to tell you that it's not too bad. So let's go over what's happening. And this is kind of like a guide of what to do after getting shafted on the darken anniversary banners and also how to like help you out kind of thing because trust me on these banners you have a higher chance of being shafted than you do for not getting shafted which is you know not a good thing of course but that's how darken is okay but i do want to remind you guys if you do like darken content don't forget to hit that like and subscribe button we're trying to hit 400 so hopefully we can get that sorted but anyways Let's get on to the video though. So the LR MEY banner and the LR Super Saiyan Blue Evolution banner. Now some of you guys may have not even got shafted. Maybe you did end up pulling like, I don't know, maybe you got like three LR Gohans and you got like two LR Boo Tanks, which is pretty good, right? Pretty good. But you never got the one copy of MEY and that's what people mainly wanted. Now... Same could be said for SSBE. You could have pulled MUY but not SSBE and you're currently trying to go as far as you can in to get SSBE. And you know, of course, that's okay. But if you did not get any of them or you only got one of them, I'm here to say it doesn't matter really and that this is why, okay. So first of all, for the people still summoning, if you do see this video, cause you know, the banner is still on, you may check out this video when the banner's gone, do summon until that three plus one is gone. As soon as that three plus one is gone, technically the banner is over. The banner is over as soon as you get, miss out on that extra stuff with the tickets and all that. Now, nah, do not touch it. Do not touch that banner. But let's go on about why I am okay. Because by the way, many of you guys don't know how my summons went. I end up getting one Super Saiyan Blue Evolution could not get the MUI Goku myself but I did get like a rainbow boo tank which is kind of nice but I don't mind because you know I know that he will be mine soon enough and the main reason is is because of this stuff let me show you right here so part two is coming to JP part two and the main thing about part two is it also comes with another dark and banner which is going to be the top legendary summon this banner consists of two LRs, which are for that representatives of Universe 17. If you are a person that got shafted here, or got shafted here, if you got actually shafted, shafted, you need to fully skip this banner. This banner is like a, a kind of accessorizing your Rep 17 if you pulled both of the LRs for part one. If you didn't, there is no point going for them, and I will explain why, because these guys are pretty nice, but they're nothing, they're no necessity, right? They're no necessity. So this banner will be a skip for you shafted ones, you know, it's time to go on that team save stones. I've been saying it loads, hashtag team save stones. Jump on the hype, get those stones sorted, because if we check what's coming out real soon, you can see I've got the boot tanks here. And the main reason why I have Bootanks here is look at the date where he came out. The 29th of August 2020. And uh, you know who was featured or you know what happened on the 29th of August? There will be the download celebration banners. Now, of course, JP, I mean, Global gets a little bit shafted considering that the anniversary, like, you know, these things. And also this is so close together because, you know, this is needed. This is also a reason why you should not use any coins on this banner for like either the Strength Goku Vegeta or the Boo Tanks. Don't use any reds here because they will be featured again in the, or the download celebration or worldwide celebration, whatever you want to call it. And it's not that far. It's literally a month and a half away. So, you know, yeah, you tried to summon for these new guys, you didn't get them. You know, you got to put that in the past. You got to start saving for these banners now. You need to start saving for these banners. And the good thing about these banners, like both the MUI banner, SSBE banner, 
and the download celebration banner is this is the big thing they are all red coin banners now if you have been preparing for this whole thing this whole anniversary for a long time you must have put inside your head that you may get shafted you you know it's gonna happen but that's okay because if we check here 4th of December is when we get the Tanabata banner. This is the 2020's Tanabata banner. And we got this banner 4th of December. And look who was featured in here. We have the 5th year anniversaries. And if we have a look at the 6th year of Tanabata. The 6th year anniversary units are here. And this is very important because this means you only have to wait between... Uh, when did MUA exactly come out? I think it was Ju yeah, July 9th to 4th of December. So that's about five months, give or take. Five months is what you have to wait to buy your copies of uh, Blue MUA or Int Super Saiyan Blue Evolution, that type of stuff. So you guys will need to get those red coins sorted. Now, if you spent your red coins by accident, I do think summoning for the download celebration with everything they give, you should be able to get quite a lot of reds. I mean, not if you've hit zero red coins, but if you've been stacking up quite a bit, you should be able to get ready. And of course, this is a guy many people would like to summon for, of course, but I would not recommend summoning on this banner to get him. Like, this banner is the coin banner. If you want this guy, you go for the banner that has 10 to 12 featured units, not the one that has t like, t I don't know, how much? 1, 2, 3, 4, 20 featured units or something. That's just not, that's not manageable, right? That's just silly. You could drop a thousand stones and end up getting like two physical Vegito blues, a strength Janemba and a strength Geo. Like, do not do actual stones on this banner. Literally just for using your coin. And that is it. That is literally all I did want to tell you boys. So if you did get shafted, there's it's not the end of the world. I know a lot of people are quitting Darken over the shaft. You gotta understand it happens, move on. You know, next just look up forward to the next banner. Time to go into that team save mode. Obviously, do try your hardest to get whichever one you're going for. But if you didn't get them, it doesn't matter. Skip this banner, save up. Download celebration is the time for you to drop dragon stones because you know you'll be getting you will be getting a lot of dragon stones as well. And then hopefully you have your red coins in December ready for the boys to come back. Because I know as soon as they come back, I'm gonna grab like maybe two MUI Go because you know get it with a dupe, you know? Or maybe an extra SSBE, you know, you can mess around a bit. But that is waiting till December, and it's not that long. Five months. Now the reason why I do say go. Cool, Bloody hell, I did not want to do that. Now the reason why I do say is go really hard on this banner. The main reason is, is because he comes out 29th of August 2020. Now this is download celebration in a nutshell. If you don't pull the download celebration units, this is why you need to focus on this now. So 29th of August, the next time he is featured is going to be 9th of July. So it's going to be like about 11 months 10 months wait if you don't pull the download celebration units instead of the five months waiting for the MUI SSPE so yeah now it's time to focus a bit on download celebration and that is the end of the video hopefully this video helped a bit of you out you know some of you boys like yo it's the end it's never the end you just have to go through a little bit of time not having the units and it don't matter it really just doesn't matter you know, there, there are way stronger units out there. If you pull MUY, but say if you didn't pull MUY and you ended up pulling the... Where is he? You know, say if you ended up pulling either Boo Tanks or you ended up pulling, like, the Strength Goku Vegeta, right? These are still one of the best LRs in the game. So, like, you still can clear most of the stuff you want. And you're like, oh, but I can't see the, anim the animations of MUY SSBE. Just take, a, just take this as a friend. Just take... Just take this as a friend if you really want to see them that badly. And you can just run like a rep 7 team with the other guy as a friend lead, you know, easily. Easily. But that's going to be it, my boys. Hopefully this video helped some of you out. And, you know, 
you could use this for any type of shaft really you know if you get shafted on a normal dock and first you could be like don't worry there are other banners coming out trying to save up some red coins or yellow coins depending on how you got shafted but yeah this is kizan bouncing out and i will catch you on the next dock and video in a bit guys